30 after police in Providence catch up with a home invasion suspect, a standoff ensues, but it all wrapped up with a peaceful ending. Eyewitness News reporter Julie Raditsky joins us now with the full details, new at 5.30. A tense situation this morning. Police first got word of a home invasion on Knight Street. They were able to track down the suspects to another home. The only problem, they weren't ready to surrender. In full SWAT gear with guns drawn, the Providence Police Special Response Team surrounds this Hanover Street home around 8 this morning after learning that several people were inside, including women and children. Negotiators on scene convinced the suspects to give up, and two men were taken away in handcuffs. A short time later, women and children, still in their pajamas, were spotted exiting the home, shaken up but safe. It is still unclear the motive for this home invasion, but Providence Police tell Eyewitness News they were able to locate the suspect's vehicle nearby on Knight Street, where the initial home invasion was reported. Neighbors calling all of this just nerve-wracking, but luckily the situation was resolved without someone getting seriously hurt. And Providence police say one man was treated for minor injuries after getting hit in the head with a firearm during the invasion. As for those two suspects, they were arrested and transported to Providence police. Julie Raditsky, Eyewitness News.